Hey everyone, Justin from the Rap Institute. In this TWI tool tip, the focus is on the wrap axe. Now, what I just did is I put the material on the top, color change film, tucked it into the molding right there, very tight gap. So I did the tuck and cut too. Tucked it once with the buffer side of the TWI platinum squeegee and the round side. And the idea is to cut it and then finish it off with the square side of the squeegee. But I'm actually going to cut it and finish it with the wrap axe, really cool. And I think this is a really, really tricky cut in a sense that right now, if I come in with my knife, and there's definitely videos of me showing this with a knife on the car, is that it's just really advanced cutting. Super tight gap, the chance of you making a bad cut on such a long run and a tight gap is really high. So lots of stress. And I'm gonna show you with the wrap axe right now, no stress. And one thing I found on the wrap axe is, on the sharp side, what I like to do is before I go into a cut like that, I have a little bit of sanding paper here and I can actually smooth out the edge and make it nice and sharp. Once that's set now, awesome. I'm gonna come in here and what I do is I just push the wrap axe into the material now, kind of angle the wrap axe up, and then I just make my cut. So what I love about the wrap axe right now is it has that beveled edge right now. So there's no chance of the corner of the wrap axe catching the film. And man, <laughs> peace of mind. If you're installed for any length of time right now, you know the focus and energy you have to put into this cut because you're worried about cutting the car, cutting the rubber, and I'm talking on camera like this is nothing because you know what? It's nothing. Super easy cut all the way down. And I can even add clear. So I set them away. You can see how clean it is cut. They're there. And then once I do that, watch what I do. I come back in with the same tool and I seal the deal. Awesome. So in one movement, I cut the whole run. And in one movement, I seal the deal. And that, for me, is about as great of a tool as you could ever dream for. And this is sold exclusively on the Rapid Stew page. I actually got a little bridge right there, so I'm actually going to push it in right there. Cut it nice and clean. And voila. So now I got perfect finish right in the gap. No chance of cutting rubber. Hope you enjoy.